this one. Um, I would use this to like for nose job for reconstruction. You close your eyes. Okay, well, do you have an appointment? Yes. Okay. Let me check you in. What was your name? Okay. You're here for the one o'clock. Okay, perfect. Okay, and let's get some information on what you want. Were you looking for dramatic change, just a minor change. What kind of like look were you looking for? Sure, yeah, I could tell you about different like stages. So our most basic is just some like permanent makeup, some eyeliner, some eyelash extensions are permanent, um, not actually permanent, but you know, more permanent than like normal eyelash extensions and carving of the features, just slimming down the face. Um, and there are more like extreme surgeries or just um, like for example, this one. Um, I would use this to like for nose job for reconstruction. So we would like. You know, um, shadow your nose, and then just fully reconstruct it. So this is more like of the extreme surgery side. Um, then we have like permanent eyeshadow. Um, we have lip injections. Um, so like, what are you thinking? Yeah, okay. Yeah, we can definitely do that. So you want to touch up your eyelashes. You want to add like the permanent eyelash extensions and you want to tie them as well. Okay. And um, permanent eyeshadow. Yeah, we can definitely do that. What kind of color scheme do you think you're looking for? Okay. Yeah, we can do that. Alright. Um, okay. And any other procedures? Lip injections? Sure. Of course. Okay, and um, anything else? Well, if I look at you here, I mean, you could do like some accentuate. You have really nice, you know, bone structure. You could definitely like accentuate it. Kind of like contouring, but permanent. Or just kind of sculpt it out, carve it out. Yeah, you want to do it just for your cheekbones? Sure. Yeah, I can definitely do that. Sure. Okay. So, is that kind of all? You want to do your, um, your eyeshadow, your eyelashes, lip injections, and sculpting cheekbones? Yeah, I think like for a first time plastic surgery user, I think that's good. I think that's good. Okay. So, I would like to measure your features to, I'd like to measure your features just to see like what we should do. Is that okay? Okay. Let me put some hand sanitizer on. So, first, 
when you measure, just make sure to spot figure out where you are, like, you know, in relation to your features, in relation to, like, the golden ratio, just, like, how everything's aligning, see maybe, like, you know, how things would look, um, most cohesive, most aligned with, um, the golden ratio, just, like, what we perceive to be aesthetically pleasing, so, not that you need to look aesthetically pleasing, but it's a good starting taste to know what that looks like and just make like choices based on personal taste from there. Is that okay? Okay, good. Okay, so I'm gonna measure you in centimeters because they're smaller. <laughs> so I think that makes the most sense. Um, so first, um, can you close your eyes? So, that's going to be mm, about two centimeters. Okay, let me write that down. Mm, okay. Left and right, two centimeters. And let's measure your right eye. Okay, so, also about two centimeters, good. So, that's symmetric. Symmetrical. Okay. And now, let me measure length of your face. So, okay. Okay. Good. So far, so good. So far, very much in line with symmetry. And now we measure the width of your face. And you have an oval face. Okay. Um, let me measure the distance between your eyes and your eyebrows. Okay. And again, it's even on both sides. So that's good. And your eyebrows. Yeah, you have really beautiful eyebrows. I can definitely see why you wouldn't jump to dungeon to use them. Okay. Alright, and your nose. Okay, and your nose shape is. Okay. Yeah, you have a really nice nose as well. Okay, so based on what I'm seeing, um, your ratios are looking very balanced, so I do think that it's good that we're going with fairly um, minor adjustments. I think that the cheekbone accentuation is going to look really good as well because you do have more of that high fashion look. Yeah, with some people it's like, if they have more of like, you know, rounded che cheeks, it's like, you know, you kind of usually want to go with the flow of what you naturally have, accentuate that, because you kind of like fighting, like, an uphill battle if you're just completely, you know, going against your nature. So, yes. Okay. Well, why don't we start with our numbing treatment? Um, where did my number go? Let's see. Okay. I'm going to warm it up with my hand. So, I'll 
start with numbing your can you close your eyes for a moment? Your eyes. And your lips. We'll numb them a little bit more later as well. And going to tie to um, tape your your eyes open for the eyelash procedure okay so can you look up for me look up okay. thinking of just black or like a fun color or a combination of colors does any of these do any of these call your name okay yeah we can definitely do just black it is definitely the safe option okay so look up for me look up Tape your eyes from the camera. Okay, now can you look down for me? Because I'm gonna do your eyeshadow. Okay, look down. Okay, now I'm gonna tape your eyes closed. So just close your eyes. Okay, so, and you said you wanted um, blue, yellow, and purple. What? And you said I wanted on my inner side yellow, and then I transitioned to blue and purple on the outside. Yeah, I could definitely do that. Okay. Start with the, oh, almost forgot to do the base. Almost forgot to do the base. Looking down over where we are down your plan. Eyes. Right, right, right. Yes, I need to put down the space so that it um, okay, perfect. Okay, so let me start with the yellow. Okay. 
are now going to do your lip injections. I'm doing a real good one. The tape. How are you doing? Good? You think okay? Perfect. Perfect. Would you like to see now or wait until the end when the cut of the swelling goes down? It's a more realistic depiction. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we can definitely. Okay, so now for your lips. Put all of this back. Like I said, we'll numb them a little bit more. We did it earlier to give it some time to set in. So now I'm gonna numb your lips a little bit more. You have to close your mouth. <laughs> numb it a little bit more. And you said you want it kind of like just a slight, just a slight on both top and bottom. this and I'm just going to do it insert on the top there and okay. and then I'll put some more for your body. this knife, the scalpel, because I know you said you don't want the two extreme version. So I have the scalpel and I'm just gonna carve out the cheekbones. Okay. Does it hurt or is it numb? It's numb. Okay. great on time. So now I'm just gonna put some sunscreen on to protect you because now your face is gonna be super, um, you know, susceptible to sun for a while. So. some complimentary sunglasses for your eyes as you leave. So let me put those on for you. Okay. Um, well, I hope that you had a great experience. Make sure to leave a review and um, just let us know how you're healing. So call for any questions. Yeah. Alright. Bye. Have a good one.